spend my Mondays like Fridays I spend my Fridays in a box With my heart and my whining I put my pinings on pedestals Instead of keeping them grounded What's that mountain to nothing? Alright, here we go We made it to Flying J we Got the cars looking good Finally all cleaned up We're gonna weigh the cars uh, We're gonna weigh the cars And make a, make a cool video about it Um it's been on our to-do list for a very, very long time and finally getting to it, thank God. Um, and then today, we are taking Yusuf's car to Showtime and he's gonna run it down the strip for the very first time because uh, he's actually gonna be part of the shootout, Ikaboo's bracket out in Ohio. Um, so pretty excited about that. Hey, so wait. Unfortunately, we didn't make it to the shootout. Um, during the same week, essentially hurricane ian came through during that time the trajectory of the hurricane was heading straight to tampa As you guys know that right at last minute kind of made a swerve and it hit a little bit south um, so we didn't get hit that that hard but you know at the time the decision was to stay home and take care of home take care of shop and everything so fortunately we didn't make it uh, we're super happy for everyone that did anyway this doesn't change the trajectory of the video um, but um i didn't want to leave you guys hoping um, for some shootout footage that we unfortunately don't have. Anyway, going back to it, let's go. You can get some drinks first. So you're gonna run your shit with me today? I think I could. I mean, my shit's gonna be crazy. Yeah, it's 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 gonna be crazy. Alright, if it breaks, you paying for it. Because I'm doing this for you. Remember, he kept saying he's gonna. Yeah, Bobby. Yeah, Bobby. Send me that $800, bitch. Send me my $800, bitch. Life's like a party out with Pennywise. That's a stroke of my ego out the tip of a fountain. Pen me in, swear to God, I love a box break out of. Come around the mountain, I'ma run straight through it. This be some great Buick music, like a budget be cooler than violent out when you get in the ecosystem, nervous like a school full of shooters. Keep it all on the loop, like a rapper producer. God watch it and he laughing like it's all a big joke. Maybe that's the way to tackle all this hardship on the road. Like, that'll be perfect. Is going After they right. couldn't find it. And that's the way it goes. We are about to uh, bring our cars here to get weighted. Uh, the idea of this is to compare uh, our full bolt-on cars with full interior like mine. Um, and then Yusef's gutted. Yusef's Wrong. gutted uh, EcoBoost drag race car. So we're going to set up a GoPro there. We're going to set up an Insta 360 inside the cars. The purpose of this is obviously to document everything that we're doing, um, not only for Yusef and his drag racing career, uh, aside from his street racing career, but we want to be able to document and learn how to document and uh, be able to put something together that we're going to be able to use later on. And obviously the, um, the weight of these cars and a lot of people that want to save weight, you know, this could be a really good video for them. And then we're just gonna see if the stuff that we've done to it have actually Helped. better or worse than um, the actual weight of the car. So, bunch of trucks being moved out here. So, let's get to work. Nah, let's see how we can work this out. We the top tier. UGK the major way, not play it. It don't stop here. Traffic lights, we going. Know the time and set a clock. No, it's on roll. We doing digi to the whole block. Clear. Yo, what you got there? Oh, did you not hear? And he's taking over and we got the whole shot. Alright guys, so you saw uh, Yusuf's car coming in. The uh, process is pretty easy. It's the first time doing this. So you kind of pull up with the car and uh, they ask you uh, what you're weighing. I'm assuming it's because it's not 10,000 pounds. So they ask you if it's personal or military. Obviously it's personal. I don't understand. I don't know what the military thing is. Maybe there's a discount. Maybe there's, uh, maybe there's I don't know, uh, no charge. Yusuf is actually getting my car right now and we're going to weigh my car as well. So my car is full bolt-on and full weight. There's no, uh, you know, weight reduction at all done to my car. Yusuf, on the other hand, as you guys have seen, is gutted. You know, he took the rear balance out. He's done a couple of things here and there. Uh, we have done suspension mount. You know, we're pretty much hoping that it's under 3,300 pounds. I'm counting that mine is a little bit, it's probably gonna be like 3,500 pounds. We have a couple of uh, trucks coming in and, uh, and then we have my car. I don't know, pretty good day today so far. By the way, if you guys haven't been to PP-FL, our website, and actually gotten yourself one of these, you have to get yourself one of these. 25% off PP-FL, get yourself one of these. You say that all is good. You say that all is great. I say that y'all can hang. And that's cause y'all seem fat. That's cause y'all seem You say that all is good. You say that all is great. I say that y'all can hang. Yo, it's hot as in this 
We just finished writing both cars. Uh, a huge thank you to Flying J over here and the ladies taking care of us. Let's get out of here. Let's go get our tickets and uh, see what we got. You can watch your bits and pieces when I eat you and see my inner demons when I scream and cry and reboot. But peace, dude. Walk away and throw my deuces up. Tracks from my brother who died, who never knew me much. For that fucker who trashed me, all I threw was love. For my mom, so I would put up with my camera. stupid sure. stuff. Yeah, Face the yeah, on recording. every single bruise and cut. For suburban stoners getting high and making Lucy runs. For everybody who threw me love, I'm here to throw it back. I don't. Cap, all right, so this is fucking terrible. You're good. You're good. Uh, we just got our results. Um, we're not gonna say it right here, right now. Yeah, we're not. Let's get to the shop and uh, let's show the guys. Yeah. All right, guys, we're back at the shop. Um, we just came from the Flying J, as you guys saw, uh, from us weighing our cars. Here are the results. We kind of wanted to wait until we got to the shop to actually tell um, everyone here um, the results for the cars because um, it's kind of like not what we expected. I'm going to be completely honest with you. So everybody's here? Yeah, what we got? Cool. All right. So here we go. Uh, what was y'all guesses for use this car? 3500. 35? Being a 3300, 3380, 3390. 3380, 3390. I'm gonna say 3267. All right, Yusuf's car, without him in it, full tank of gas, 3460. With a full tank of gas. With a full tank of gas, 3460. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But All I mean, we've offset a lot, I mean. We did. Right. Uh, 3460 for Yusuf's car, uh, we did the math, subtracted the 130 from the full tank of no, gas. Yeah. 3330, which That's is- not bad. Not bad at all. But you're not running with no gas. No. Yeah, no doubt. But if you were to And in run, all honesty, you're most often better to run with a full tank of gas for more than one reason. Mm -hmm. First reason being fuel pump, uh, fully submerged. Uh -huh. I don't have any issues with fuel pump starvation. So that's the first reason. Second reason is weight, weight transfer. Put all that weight over the rear tire. That's why people move the batteries to the back. The right, right, right. Right, so he's gonna have a uh, help with squat, you know what I mean? Bet. So 3460, uh, my car, uh, net weight was supposedly- now, your car is a manual. 3450. As opposed to an auto, yep. it's lighter. So it's lighter because the, we picked them both up. Yeah. It's definitely lighter. Yep. Um, but yours is also a base model like his. Um, and yours is still full interior and everything. Yeah. So it's 3460, yours is, was it full tank of gas as well? You filled up as well? Empty. Empty. 20 miles in this car. Oh, so he cheated. So that's 130 off. So. And he was in my car. Well, I'm 140, so let's count it as if he right. was full weight. Like with full tank. 3,700 pounds. I thought 36. Oh, I Minus 36. 150. 140. 140 is whatever that number is. 3550, I think it was. 35 and change. Without gas and everything, 35 and change. Now let's go with the RCR. Yeah, 37 for my car. <laughs> yep. So his Yusuf's car, 3460 and 3700 pounds with his uh, light ass in my car. Yeah. So yeah, I bet my car is probably 4,000 pounds. Easily. No, easy. That's Dude, easy. I think bro, it's. Yeah. Hey, bro, if my car is that much, yeah. your car is at least. Dude, if my car is that much. Yeah, if he's 37. <laughs> I was like, what? I've probably got 300 pounds of wiring in my car just for the lights. <laughs> <laughs> just for all the lights. The yeah, <laughs> yeah. Anyway, we had to wait and come out here to show you guys because we knew we were going to get some kind of faces yeah, bro. From, from this. But, I mean, in consideration, 3,300 pounds, 3,500 pounds for mine. We haven't taken anything off. It's not bad. Thank God it's no leather and shit because that well, would be completely yeah, different. And I mean, remember, uh, race car, right? 20... What was it? 20... 28.75. That's, that's real, like, there's not a single thing in that car right. that is not necessary. Yeah. yeah. All the way down to the ECU. Like, the ECUs, the OEM is all gone, wow. and it's got the lightest of everything, you know? Mm -hmm. So, yeah. I mean, a 3,300-pound street car is... So, question. Do you think it's possible for me... Because, I, you know, I don't give a fuck about, like, how comfortable the car yeah. is. Like, I really don't care. Is it an attainable goal? To get to like at least like let's say 3100 with a full tank um 
you're going to save probably 50-ish pounds, maybe 60-ish pounds by going to the tubular K-member yeah, with right. no sway bar. You could replace your driver's seat with like a Kirky. You'd save somewhere in the neighborhood of 30-ish pounds probably doing that. Um, so, I mean, there's things that you can do for sure. It's just that the cost and the return, this is not a poor man's game. The weight savings game is almost as diminishing of a return as the NA game. Mm. It, it's just like very expensive to do very little. Mm. And that's not to say the weight savings isn't important. I'm just saying it's not cheap. It's way cheaper to turn up the boost a couple PSI with a weight skate or with a, than it is. Spring. Right, you know, like you could do a spring upgrade, you could do a tune up, you're a couple hundred bucks here, a couple hundred bucks of labor, a couple hundred bucks on a tune change. Whereas, you know, you're talking about doing a K member, you're talking about $500 for the K member, a couple hundred dollars, a couple hundred dollars for the adapters to make the K member fit the EcoBoost because they don't fit the EcoBoost. Mm. Um, then the labor, you're several hundred dollars in the labor, and then all of that to take off the sway bar to now have less turning. You know, not that it's it's not detrimental. We've it's driven them. Shit. It's race car shit. Um, but like the return is just a diminishing return in comparison to upping the power. But at some point we were kind of at this uh, dead end of increasing power until we either go to a built block, a larger turbo, um, or can, can, so that's kind of one of those things where you dead ended into the the maximization of what we could do on a stock block. So you have to seek out those other things. And unfortunately, the weight savings is just not going to have the same amount of return on investment um, as these ones that we've done over here so far. Right. But yeah, I'm, I mean, we can do it without question. It's just, uh, you have to be dedicated to do it, that's all. Yeah, for sure. And that's kind of the reasons why we are even doing all of this. We were brainstorming on Saturday, this past Saturday, and decided, all right, well, uh, Yusuf wants to be in the, at the shootout, and we need to make sure that we know the ins and outs of the car, and it starts by making sure that, all right, so what's the weight of the car? And just like they were talking about, power to weight ratio, and just kind of working at it from there. Um, we were able to achieve that today, so hope you guys enjoy that YouTube video. And uh, if there's anything else that we're missing, I'm um, pretty sure we can get it and gather it yeah, from anywhere sure. else. B rolls, photos of the cars later on today, and we'll finish it up. Anyway, all right, that was that. See you later, alligator. I mean, bro, this, this is why we came here today, so that he could get this practice, bro. Right. Straight up, 100 percent. Yeah, and he feels better. He, yeah. he feels more confident. He's like, yeah. he's all excited now. You see, like that's the thing. Guys, if you ever have the chance, time on task over time. Get out, practice. Don't let these other motherfuckers clown you. Don't let them say some shit. Fuck that shit. Get out there and fucking rape.